And this is a video of all my shows. Actually, this is not all my shows when I still have shows inside the Kravitz Hat for, um, for, for them. But this is what I've all collected. This show right here is what Nemo got came into came into when, when I got him from Animal when I got him from Animal Jungle and um with um with some Dalek. This this show that I bought from Florida, nobody cannot see nobody can't wear this one. Because the way the opening is it's it's a very it's, um narrow D shape. But it's very wide, so they cannot they cannot have get their legs to to get into it. Even the jumble here cannot get it because it's very narrow. But really, um, crabs with um very narrow, very very flat carapaces like ease can get into this. So nobody can't wear that one really. But. This is um so I have show I have shows that my hermit crabs cannot wear. Cause over the time um I couldn't I I didn't know what they can wear and what they can't. I don't know. This what this one right here um they can't they can wear this cause it's a round opening but you know um you stick your finger in it. You know it's kind of narrow over in the inside so. And it's a little bit heavy. And I said that these shells right here are growth shells. But it's pretty heavy. Hammer crabs cannot go in the shells that are too heavy for their bodies. Because, um, this one I got from... Um, this one I got from my boyfriend. They, they keep shells. They keep shells in, in the box too. And... Some of them I got um, these um these um African land snail shells. This one's an African land snail shell. This one's a smaller one. And I got a couple of tulip shells. This one is a little bit bigger than this one. I also got these like tiger land snail shells. Nobody hasn't been nobody hasn't moved into that one because it has like a little funky spiral. This one's another one of those growth shells, just like this one. I have a couple of these, you know, a few of these. Yeah, a few of these along with this one. When a hermit crab goes into a shell, they want to see comfort. So, these in the round, you know, these. They call these girl shells. <laughs> but, it's a very much of a heaviness they can't look at. Yeah, like, can't look at. Another one of those two lips. Goes in the nose category. Yeah, I like this one too, but you know, like I was saying about their abdomen, you know, this is kind of narrow. And it would feel tight in there. I got a few Marix ones. Yeah, but some of them have holes in them. That's why. Oh, like, like this one has a hole, like right here. And I don't put shells in there that has holes in them because. I don't want to have their abdomens exposed. I have two of these. This one has this on the bottom. Right there. That's why I couldn't put it in. And another one of these that Lexi is wearing. It's like you want to pick up a crab like this. <laughs> this is one of those viola kind of shells. I'm keeping this in the future when I get my violas and I get a viola tank. I am not the kind of person that does mix species together because they could be my problems. This one right here is one of those D opening shell. But yeah, this is also heavy and it's very narrow on the inside. It's a very funky spiral still. My hermit crabs cannot really wear this, but you know. 
One of the little mirrors should put this on there because sometimes, sometimes they can wear mirror shells, like Hansel's wearing mirror Um, when Hexus did her first shell change video, she, she wanted this one. This one's another one of those. Oh, I got, oh, mixed species of shells. That, And this is all the turbos I got. See, this is from big, this is from big to smaller. Now I've got this one. They can't go into this one because this one's like big. But I'll try to see. Sometimes they could surprise me and move into move into a shell that they haven't moved into before. That's why I still keep them. But her shells are broken on the top. It's okay. It, but still, I'm concerned about their soft eyes have been getting scratched on this. So I keep that out. It's another one of those girl shells that go in this category. Yeah. So I'm going. I'm going to separate out all the turbos and the more comfortable shells. And so, I had these in a couple of these cups and, um, this, <laughs> whoops, this thing in here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop in a few marbles. These are really nice marbles. I love marbles. Yeah, the, look at all these shells, and they're not dull, the shells. They are not all the shells. And I got some more shells coming in from Naples Shell Supply. So that's what it is about.